film is finished in August 1942, Jack Warner, who's the head of Warner Brothers Studios, has a marketing problem because Americans don't know where Casablanca is. I mean, the, the American familiarity with Morocco and North Africa is very limited. So he's got this film with Bogart and Bergman and Henri, and it's really good. But how do you market it? How do you get them interested? Well, Operation Torch kind of solved that problem for him. On the morning of November 8th, the American public woke up to reports that the Western Task Force, 33,000 American soldiers were coming ashore in French Morocco and their goal was to seize Casablanca. So all of a sudden, Americans know where Casablanca is and they're now interested in Casablanca and Warner Brothers has a film called Casablanca. Jack Warner and Warner Brothers Studios would get another publicity bump in January of 1943 when Roosevelt and Churchill come to Casablanca for the conference. But it also reifies the way that Casablanca is part of the war. And the movie becomes part of the American war experience in a way that was never intended. But in a sense, it helps World War II live on in American cultural memory.